proud of what he's done. That's the response from a Chinese scientist who says he helped create the world's first genetically edited babies. Dr. He Jinkui says he edits the embryos of twin girls born in China, and he says another pregnancy is now in its early stages, which means a third genetically altered baby could be born. He says he altered the embryos with the goal of making the babies genetically resistant to contracting the HIV virus. They need this protection since the HIV vaccine is not available. And uh, I have personal experience with uh, some people in the some AIDS village where 30% of village were, uh, people were infected. Dr. He has received scathing rebukes from fellow scientists who are gathered here in Hong Kong for the Human Genome Editing Conference. They say there are already regularly practiced methods for preventing the transmission of HIV. They've condemned the secrecy surrounding his process, which hasn't been independently verified or peer-reviewed, and they've raised ethical questions. The chair of the summit, Nobel Prize winner David Baltimore, condemned his actions, calling them irresponsible. I don't think... Uh, uh, it has been an, a transparent process. We've only found out about it um, after it's happened and after the children are born. Um, I personally don't think that it was medically necessary. He defended his work here at the summit in front of the same group that in 2015 set guidelines to regulate against the implantation of genetically altered embryos without further research and without more consensus building first. He says his clinical trial is currently on hold. Chinese authorities say they're investigating and the university where He says he did his research says they knew nothing about the work he was doing. In Hong Kong, Alexander Field, CNN.